It's your boy The Difference and welcome back to the channel. Well, after last video, I failed the Dead Space Impossible run. I will be back later, but I just bought Persona 5 Golden. And if you know me, if you watch the channel at all, you don't even have to watch the channel. If you go look at my playlist, I beat Persona 5 Royal on this channel. It was my first walkthrough on this channel. It's hilarious, but bad quality. That's when I was recording on my PS5. Those days were terrible. Like, it's a funny playthrough, but horrible quality. And I beat a Nuzlocke of Shin Megami Tensei 5. And I was doing a Nuzlocke of Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne. So, I'm, I play Atlas games. I play Atlas RPGs. I play them all the time. So, Persona 5, I mean, Persona 4 Golden is right up my alley. And, yeah, that's what I wanted to start doing. I'm still sad I fell a dead space, though. But, but let's get into it. I'm, in, I'm about to start this Persona 4 Golden. I've never played it. I never played Persona 4 Golden ever. Never seen a walkthrough. I've seen some videos on it, but I've never seen a walkthrough. Me playing on very hard. Y'all know what I do. There you go, my guy. Long nose, motherfucker. My man's. You ugly as shit. It seems we have. My name is Igor. My I'm man, Igor. No, okay, whatever. Ah, this is Margaret. She is a resident of this place. Like, my name is Margaret. I am here to accompany you through your journey. Oh, you the twins, right? You got split up into two little girls. That's you as a whole woman. I oh, see. I for I remember. I'm back. I'm getting back into it. I remember some of this shit. I remember. My man Igor and my girl Margaret. Hold on now. Slim down this summer with the refreshing taste of calorie magic. And we're back. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't think that's gonna help you at all, fat ass. I just don't. At first he bags a single. That's me? He ain't got a, He don't got as much swag as my man Joker, but I'll make it work. Well, you're more handsome in person than in your photo. I don't swing that way, man. Go about your business. Welcome to Inaba. I'm Ryotaro Dojima. I'll be looking after you. Let's see, I'm your mother's younger brother, and that about sums it up. Well, Kai. Okay. What's a good unk? Huh. You probably don't remember, but we've met. I've changed your diapers before, you know? This you here's my daughter. Push the motherfucker like that. Come on, Nanako. Introduce yourself to your cousin. <laughs> What's good, cousin? Uh. Why are you scared of me? <laughs> what are you so shy for? Ow! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> my car's over there. Motherfucker. Mink. Hey. Who is you? Unfriendly looking girl. You drop this. Oh, thank you. Whatever. All I did was pick it up. You can't fucking take the fucking thank you. Hi. Welcome to Mo. Get the fuck out the way. Can you go to the bathroom by yourself? Who was uh -huh. you talking to? You, you better be talking to her. I'm a grown ass man. You better be talking to her. It's in the back to your left. You know which way's left? The side you don't hold your chopsticks in. 
Hey, stop talking about my cousin like that, like she a dumbass. She know what the fuck left is? She know what the fuck left is, boy? Are you taking a trip? Oh, women, I don't know who the fuck City. you are, attendant. Fill up my car while you're at it. Regular. Right away, sir. Good time as any first. What the fuck is this motherfucker's name? Are you in high school? Talking about my cousin like she a dumbass. Boy, to see how little there is out here. There's so little to do. I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. Like everybody else would fucking do, dumbass. Speaking of which, we're actually looking for part-time help right now. Trying to proposition me to get a job? I ain't want to do all that. What? I don't want to work here. Ah shit! I'm up to no fucking good. Yes, sir. Yeah. I can't risk the Jonah. Whatever. This shit loud as fuck. Thank you. What the fuck is the point? What's up, mamas? Okay. This is pissing me off. I'm ready. Ain't no one was no one was on anything, bro. Fuck the. Uh. Dojima speaking. Mhm. Mm yeah. I see. Uh huh. huh. Looks like. Sorry, but I gotta go. I don't know how late I'll be. Nanako, you help him out, okay? Okay. I hate it when he does this. Um, it must be tough. It's always like this. My dad's a detective. Okay. And now for the local news. City Council Secretary, Taro Namatame, is under fire for an alleged relationship with a female reporter. Alleged, he definitely did His that wife, shit. Enka ballad sensation Misuzu Haragi revealed to this station that she will likely pursue damages. In response, iTelevision has decided to cancel all of announcer Mayumi Yamano's televised appearances. Until allegations of an affair with Mr. Namatame are resolved, she'll remain off the air and out of the public eye. This is boring. Does the news you want it to be exciting? You want the news to be exciting? You want motherfuckers dying? You better be. You better be. You better be. Uh, grateful that the motherfucker is boring. At Juness, every day is customer appreciation day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day is great at your Juness. Every day is great at your Juness. Like, uh, Aren't you going to eat? What the fuck am I in a sleeping bag? I don't even got a bed. That's wild, bro. Really got me in the attic in a sleeping bag. That's ridiculous. You know I'm thugging it though. This is a good thing for all you can do and C4. Well, let me proceed then, motherfucker. Do you seek the truth? Not really. If it's the truth you desire, come and find me. But I really don't desire the truth. Like, I don't know. Like, my life pretty straight. I don't really need the truth. What's the truth? Sometimes the truth is devastating. Sometimes you don't want the truth. Sometimes the truth will hurt you. Do I really care about having the truth? I really don't. Mink! That ain't do shit. Okay. Yes. 
Mink! How do I already have my persona? That! I missed! Block. That was a whole bunch of nothing? You could cook breakfast, little. Good morning. Little mamas? I can toast bread and cook sunny side up eggs in the morning. Dad can't cook, so I buy dinner. You're starting school today, right? My school's on the way, so let's go to. Talented. You're, oh, what the fuck did I just say? You're talented. Motherfucker. Hey, cook. You cook for your fucking father. This is a fucking disgrace. Learn how to cook, bro. Like, what is going on? You keep going straight. My school's this way. Bye. This little girl is taking care of me, bro. What the fuck? All the dad does is drive. What the fuck? What does he do? Oh, yeah, yeah, the resident dumbass. Yep. Knew it. Alright, shut your traps. What's wrong with your teeth? I'm Kinshiro Moraoka, your homeroom teacher from today forward. First things first, just because it's spring doesn't mean you can swoon over each other like love struck baboons. Long as I'm around, you students are gonna be pure as the driven snow. Your teeth are hella distracting, my man. I swear to God, I can't focus. Now, I hate wasting my time, but I'd better introduce this transfer student. This sad sack's been thrown from the big city out to the middle of nowhere like yesterday's garbage. Who the fuck are you talking to? And he's just as much of a loser here as he was there. Yo! Just better not get any ideas about hitting on him. Why does this? Why does he have so much confidence to talk to me like Tell this? Tell me your name, kid, and make it quick. <laughs> well, my name is Daga. Wait. Yeah, courage. <laughs> That's it. You're on my shit list. Effective and What the fuck you? You just called me a loser. Now listen up. This town is miles away from your big city of perverts and assholes in more ways than one. You better not even think of getting involved with the girls here, let alone abusing them. Yo. Why is the first thing you see you you first see me call me a loser and tell me to not abuse women like bro you don't know nothing about me but what do I know it's not like the old days even here kids grow up so damn fast bro put him on a list why do you talk about the kids are so grown now put this man on a list this fucking fucking buck tooth ass bitch ass. Every hey time man, I turn my just a hating old ass old man, bro. Excuse yeah, bro, shut me, the fuck is up. it okay if the transfer student sits here? Oh, oh. she wanna fuck me. Yeah, so hurry. Why I walk like that? He's the worst, huh? Rotten luck for you to get stuck in this class. Well, we just have to hang in there for a year. Um, Miss Satanaka, this was really awesome. Like, the way he moved was just. Amazing to and I'm really sorry, it was an accident. Please just have mercy until my next paycheck. See ya, thank Stop right there. What did you do to my DVD? Ah! Oh god. Round two. What the I can't believe this! It's completely cracked! Oh! I think mine's cracked too. Critical hit to the nads. Uh, are you all right? Oh, Yukiko-san. Are you worried about me? He's fine, Yukiko. Let's ditch him and go home. Okay. 
He's not gonna have kids, but that's fine. You're Yuki, right? What? Who, who are you? What's up with him? What school's he from? Never mind that. He's going for Yukiko-san? Man, you'd think he'd at least wait until she's alone to make his move. I bet you a can of Tappy gets knocked out. <laughs> no bet. Haven't you heard how difficult the Amagi challenge is? Uh, so, uh, are you coming or not? I, I'm not going. Fine! What, what did he want? What did he want? Uh, obviously he was asking you out on a date. Huh? Really? You really had no clue? Sheesh. But then again, that was way over the top. It was creepy how he called you y Bro had no. L-Riz. Huh? Turned down another lovelorn fool, huh? Man, you're cruel. You got me the same way last year. I don't recall doing that. Oh, well, you serious? So then you want to hang out sometime? I'd rather not. That'll teach me to get my hopes up. Anyways, you two better not pick on the transfer student too much. We're just curious is all! Um, I'm sorry for dragging you into this. Come on, let's go! Everyone... Oh. So you came here because of your parents' job? <laughs> I thought it was something way more serious. No, nah, Persona 5 is because I saw a motherfucker try to get it, uh, try to fondle a motherfucker without their p permission. Well, I think it's terrifying. I can't believe a dead body showed up around nah, someone here. got murked. Wait, what did she just say? A dead body? Hey, what are you doing here? Huh, I should have figured that had happened. That damn principal. We told him not to let them through here. You know this guy? I'm Detective Dojima, his guardian. Uh, well, how should I say this? I hope you get along with him. But you three really ought to stop wandering around and head straight home. Adachi, how long are you going to act like a rookie? You want to be sent back to the central office? I'm sorry. <clears throat> we go to Juness some other time. Good idea. All right, then. We're taking off. Starting tomorrow, neighbor, let's do our best. We all live next to each other? What a coinky dink. I wonder if Dad's not coming home again tonight. Probably not. Our top story this evening concerns a bizarre case in a quiet suburb. See, here you go. This is the, the exciting news you wanted, baby girl. This is what the fuck you Around wanted. Around noon today, a woman was found dead near the Samegawa River in I The deceased has been identified as Miss Mayumi Yamano, a 27-year-old announcer at the local television station. Isn't that the motherfucker that the dude cheated on his wife with? The initial results of the Inaba Police Department's investigation have revealed... Uh, the, the Inaba Police Department! That's where Dad works! I thought you wanted exciting news. I thought it was too boring last time. You look surprised. What's going on, ma'am? What's going on? I know. That's his job, so this stuff happens. The body was found hanging from a large television antenna atop a local resident's roof. That's brutal. Authorities are uncertain as to why the body was in such a state. With the cause of death also uncertain, police continue to investigate whether the death is an accident or a homicide. How do you accidentally hang yourself from an antenna? A thick fog Come on, man, let's the area do better. has slowed their progress, and plans to fully canvas the area are delayed until tomorrow. Okay. Motherfuckers, bro. This is the Someone. second time at the same spot, 
Instead of hitting your gnats on the goddamn pole, you end up in the trash can. I think something needs to change. Bro, something. <laughs> I get it. So that's how it is. The daughter of a local family-run liquor store. And the scion of the invading chain. Ho oh, ho, the flame of forbidden love. Dude, it's not like that. Oh, really? Well, I know just the thing to cheer up that lovesick heart. You ever hear of the Midnight Channel? You're supposed to look into a TV that's switched off, alone, exactly at midnight on a rainy night. That don't seem good. While you're staring at your own image, another person will appear on the screen. And they say that person's your soulmate. What? For a second I thought you were actually going to say something useful. How can you get all excited over such... Childish, huh? You don't believe it, do you? Of course. Well, it's... Try it out. Wow. All that aside, you know that incident yesterday? You guys like, think it was murder? People don't know nothing about the Candyman and fucking Bloody Mary, bro. Just don't do it. Ooh, what if the culprit behind it was still lurking around? <laughs> Jeez. You shouldn't joke about stuff like that. Now who's the childish one? All I'm saying is... You guys better try it out tonight. Fuck, have you done it, motherfucker? I had a TV in my room? Boy, that's not my true love. That's a motherfucker getting murked. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou art the one who opens the door. I thought someone was about to pop out. I'm going in that motherfucker. God damn. Are you okay? Fuck no. By the way, did you see it? Huh? Well, I did. I seriously saw a girl, but my soulmate's a girl. What's that supposed to mean? You like girls? I couldn't quite tell who it was, but it was a girl for sure. Her hair was brown, about shoulder length. She was wearing our school uniform, and hey, I think that's the same person I saw. Oh, it's showing, it's showing, uh, it was showing death, bro. She was fighting for her fucking life in that fucking TV, bro, I swear. I couldn't make out. Wait, so you, and we saw the same girl? D does that mean we have the same soulmate? No, I just think it's showing something else than your soulmate, ma'am. How should I know? How about you, did you see? It sounds like we all saw this, but were you... That'd be one interesting dream. I like the part where you got stuck because your TV was too small. If it had been bigger. Oh, that reminds me. Our family's been talking about buying a bigger TV. Oh, yeah? Well, flat screen TVs are definitely in these days. Want to go check them out on the way back? Oh, 
Definitely. Bro, I'm the one with the magic touch. Oh, yeah. How's it work, huh? Let's get in there, bro. Wait, wait, well, that was smart. Shit, it bright. it's bright as hell. I think. Uh. Whoa. What? No, oh, stupid. Is all this fault? There's no place like this in Inaba. Hell no. But man. What are we gonna do? Let's just get to it, bro. We've been doing a whole bunch of chatting. Let's get to the action. It's a dead end. There's no exit. This is where the getting lady got killed. That. Uh, I can't hold it any longer. My blood. Yo, I got. You're going here. Well. Turn around. Like I can't. Anyways, what's with this room? Check out these posters. Their faces are all cut out. Someone must really hate this person. Dude, this chair and rope? That kind of arrangement is never good. It's tied in a noose. Is this a scarf? Hey, I think I've seen that poster before. Who cares? Let's go! I'm sick of this place. And I'm not feeling so good. Something. I'm out the body, bro. Who was that? Okay. Looks friendly. What in the world? That's what I want to know. Who are you guys? <gasps> it talked. Well, what are you? The, don't yell at me. I'm a bear. Can't you tell? I live here by myself. I've always lived here. You live here? If I was you guys, I'd hurry back to the other side. Someone's been throwing people in here. Huh? Throwing people in? What are you talking about? I don't know who's doing it. I just want them to think before they go doing things like that. Hey, what's your problem? What gives you the right to yell at us like that? What are you? Where are we? What the heck is going on here? Why are you hiding behind me? I already told you. Anyways, you should hurry back. What it comes down to is, 
You want us to get out of here, right? Well, so do we. We just don't know how, damn it! What the? Where did those TVs come from? Okay, now go, go, get out of here. I'm a busy. What's going on now? This motherfucker pushed us out, this motherfucker. Where I saw it. Look over there. What's up? Hey, you cheat some? Hey, so does that weird room we saw. Now that I. Yeah! I already I told you it was related to her death, bro. People don't be listening to me. Because I'm the new quiet kid. That's why niggas don't be listening to me, bro. Well, you said that. I'm probably going in. In the little intro episode of this, I thought I was going to be able to get past the little intro where we were actually in the fighting and shit. But, nah, it's, I've been in this bitch for an hour and 36 minutes, bro, and I'm still not there. So, I'm just ending it off right here before it gets a little too long. So, yeah, if y'all enjoyed that, comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.